Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add fade in, fade out, and this soul transition effect in Femora 10. So you know that we are under Femora 10.5, and there's a new way of adding transition in this software, so we have to learn new things. And to be honest, I feel a little bit uh, confusing uh, when using this version. So I, I, I think uh, you you may feel the same like me. So I decided to make another tutorial for you. So for beginners who don't know how to add transition effect in Filmora 10. Okay, uh, let's go. All right. So now uh, I'm inside Filmora 10.5 and we need some clips on the timeline so i'm going to use all the stock clip here and just drag and drop it onto a timeline and i'm going to press this button to view everything on the timeline so this button is very very important when you're editing video especially a long videos uh, whenever you have a long timeline you want to to view everything you can press this one uh, zoom to fit timeline or you can press the shortcut shift z on your keyboard okay Okay, so on the timeline now we have uh, the first one, the second one, all the clips just a jump cut and uh, we don't have any transition effect between them. Uh, so let's preview them first uh, with no transition effect. Okay, play. Okay. Okay, so the first transition effect you want to add is the fade in and fade out effect, right? So, uh, for example, this is the first clip. I want to add a fade in effect to the beginning of the clip here. All I need to do is to go to the transition tab here, okay? And at the transition tab, you have some folder here on the, on the left side. Um, but in Filmora 10.5, uh, we can scroll this down here. Uh, we have some subfolder here. First one, the favorite. So the, all the, the favorites uh, folder is where you store all your favorite transition effect. If you uh, like any any transition or you may want to use for uh, for your next project, you can uh, press this one, this a uh, heart icon, heart icon. Okay, so it will be in the favorite folder, and this this folder, the the downloads folder, include everything. So all the transition effect are in this download. Uh, folder okay and for other subfolder is uh, the subfolder of this download folder and you can uh, find 3d and report this all and uh, split blur or stuff like that but by the way if you want to find any transition effect you can uh, click here at the download folder and then you can search the transition effect here uh, for example you can search fade and then you get press enter to find the fade effect okay so there are two fade, but this one is a fade to black. Uh, so this is the transition effect we can add to our video at the beginning or at the end or between two clips or the timeline. Okay, so first one uh, at the beginning, uh, fade in effect at the beginning. Uh, so let's preview it now. Yes, that's nice. And you want to add. Uh, this effect to, uh, between two clips you can do the same just drag and drop it so just click it and then drag it uh, to between uh, the clips or the timeline okay so this is a fade fade to black and to the clip again this is between the clip uh, let's play it okay so it is a little bit laggy so i'm going to render the timeline and review it now for you okay okay so here's the clips after i render it uh, so you can review it uh, from the beginning with a fade in effect and also fade in effect uh, between two clips or the timeline go ahead very nice right and you can do the same with the diso transition. For example, you want to add the diso transition between two clips here. You can do the same. You search here, diso. Okay, and then you need to press enter also. And uh, here we have the diso transition effect. We can drag and drop it between clip here to create this diso transition effect uh, here at this position. Uh, we can play from here.
okay so it's it is a little bit choppy because um, of my screen recording by the way I'm going to put the the final result at the end of the tutorial so you can watch it and the other way to uh, to find all this transition uh, let's close this one uh, is to go to the subfolder here for example if you want to find the this soul transition you can go to here at the ripple and this soul so it will be here at the ripple this so uh, we have this so here some uh, some other this so uh, effect here uh, you can find here uh, in, in this subfolder also okay and uh, for the you know, fade in or fade out or stuff like that you can find it in the basic folder here all right so that is how you can add transition between clips uh, on the timeline and if you want to control the duration of the transition if i can control the type of the transition you can just uh, double click at the transition on the timeline and then you have some option here for example you can change the duration if you want to extend the duration of the transition to two seconds or stuff like that and you want to apply to all so every all the transition all the timeline will have the same duration you can click this button so all the all of this have uh, two second uh, duration and this is a type uh, you can select overlap prefix and postfix or stuff like that so it is very easy right and another way to you know, to control the duration of the transition is to uh, click here at the edge of the transition on the timeline and drag it to the left or drag it to the right or stuff like that to extend or to shorten them and there is another way to create this soul and fade in transition is to use the animation keyframe by the way if you want to learn about that trick you can let me know in the comment section below thank you very much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye bye